fact that I have to get out and close the garage, close the gate. Our door used to be automatic, but we used to have issues with the load shedding. So what we did with my sister, we made it manual. My mom Shem is closing. What would I do without that woman? So I thought, let me vlog today's trip. I think it's two days post night shift and that's my first time leaving the house. I just didn't want to wake up. Two days straight in bed, just binging on Netflix and movies and, and, and. By the way, I finally watched Fast 9 and 10. I am impressed with it. Overall, it was a great movie. Who put holes Zasim Zanz? I think I did mention on my last video that I got myself a call, which is yay. Today, I finally decided to leave the house. I am on my way to Somerset Mall to fetch my take a lot order that I made a few days ago. I was supposed to fetch it yesterday, but I was not feeling it. So I don't really like, you know, bonded or, or driving alone or whatever. I feel like I need to have like my sisters with me. I'm just gonna continue with my drive and then I will talk to you a bit later because I need to concentrate on the road. <laughs> bit dark here but it's fine we're gonna survive I fetched I take a lot package I did cut my hair um, and the reason why I cut my hair is because I did mess it up it's not even a big chop it's a complete chop I wanted to start from scratch because my hair was not healthy um i did a lot of nonsense i don't know if you've watched my previous videos but i many many years ago i used to relax my hair and then i did a big chop and i went all natural and then i decided to do another big chop two years later I started my lock journey right and I think a year and a half into my lock journey I then chopped my hair again and I wanted to experiment again with you know putting chemicals on my hair so I did the most stupidest thing I relaxed my hair but I did enjoy it that time because I was doing condos and they were like all slick and nice because we all know condos with, you know, 4C hair. After a week, everything is like, hey, hey we there. <laughs> okay. Um, so it was nice. It was nice. Um, but I hated my hair without any styling, like cornrows or braids, because it was flat. I, 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 I just don't like my hair um, when it has chemical like texturized or relaxed so i was like okay i'm gonna do a big chop but before that i wanted to put in a bit of color on my hair don't know why but i decided for my graduation i wanted blonde not just any blonde but a platinum blonde i ended up looking like a mango um, and i had to cut my hair i didn't even have E strength to actually take pictures of that so I am starting afresh with this chop I have you know few concerns with my hair specifically my hairline this is another journey right we we starting over we starting afresh I also want to grow I've got a problem with my brows right they do 
um, make me feel a bit aware. <laughs> I don't know whether, you know, that is a nice word for me saying insecure, but I, I am a bit aware of my brows, um, especially um, if I do a bit of tinting, then you can literally see that I don't have hair on the side. So I bought a few stuff to help with my hair journey, my brow journey, and just taking care of my skin because I am 32 years old. I want to look young forever. So I've decided to take care of my hair, to take care of my skin, to take care of my body, my health. Uh, my mind and my soul yeah which is the basis of this channel um it's my wellness journey you know take a lot with their packaging they will give you wow so the first thing that i bought is the vitamin c serum i feel like now a lot of people are content creators so it's like okay to be seen taking content rather than you know a few years back when people if they see you talking to a camera it's as if when we are pamban Anyway, this is how it looks. Um, I do want to... It smells amazing. You know, let's not waste. Ooh, ooh. Maybe I wanna try it. You know, tiny bit. Ooh, oh my God. I love it. I love the texture. Oh my God, it's so smooth. I watched um, a video, I think a few days ago, that was talking about you know how to apply this and that you shouldn't you must just make sure that it does not touch your face um the applicator for i think oh oh my god that is a lot there is a lot even for me so bought these anise cosmetics pure vitamin e oil this i'm gonna use there's no smell i, I don't know there's no smell. I don't know. I kind of expected vitamin E oil to have a certain smell. I don't know why, but so stupid. But this I will put on my body lotions and stuff. Um, I'm trying to you know, go all DIY. And then I also bought this mini electronic massager. This I took because I didn't want to pay the 35 rand um, for priority shipping so um i took this it was nice and cheap i don't think there's batteries inside but oh 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 hey usb is that you <laughs> this is how it looks i'm gonna try and plug it now in the car and see if you know it does the thing why am i doing this oh yes it goes here then to the USB thing. Oh, let me not break anything. Okay. Oh, oh, you're supposed to press. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, yes. I love it. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing this, but it does have a smell, though in my heart and in my mind <laughs> anyway it does have a bit of a smell i don't know if it's supposed to do that it better not explode on me so that is the massager and then this thing that made me make um this whole order i was looking for um a demo roller and some hair growth oil for my edges and my hair so it comes with the demo roller um it's in a box there's a clear co ouch ouch my nail that is why i hate having a bit of you know length on my nail because oh gosh this is from drs it's a demo roller this is the whole package um nothing to it it's stuck Am I gonna rip this thing out? Because like I am not under beautiful package. Um on Take A Lot it did say that I was ordering the 0.25, but I ended up getting the one millimeter. I don't know. Okay, it's a bit heavy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And then I also bought the original hair growth um essential oil. Uh, let me show you. 
So they came in a combo. I do wanna see. So before I was using Native Child's Hair Growth Oil, um, it does work. Oh, this is nice and thick. Oh. Ew. It, it is not so thick, you know, surprisingly. Mm. I'll be doing this every week so that, you know, we don't go overboard. But I am very hopeful that things are going to grow in here, okay? Right, I am happy with my order. How quick it came, everything inside. That's nice and... You know, it's to my expectation, um, not too crazy. Let's just go inside and see what I get. It is time for me to head home. Um, I did buy myself a Ooh, shucks. I did buy myself a Starbucks drink. This is the caramel Mochiato. Um, I think it's I don't know. I used to enjoy you know those You know type of drinks with blended ice in them. I don't know. I don't anymore I prefer my coffee with ice. Give me a normal temperature for normal people um Anyway, uh, some guy was looking at me in a weird way that is scary. So I don't know whether he's looking at me for the fact that I'm vlogging or he's looking at me like, hmm, creepy, I don't know. Um, let me go home and I don't know, I'm also running out of battery so I won't be able to have like, ugh. That's about it on this vlog. I tried to share everything that I did um, from the time that I left home, which is close to nothing, but it's something compared to yesterday. I'm still drinking my Starbucks and I think I'm gonna make supper and then go to bed, watch some more Netflix. I need to finish a series that I started yesterday. I did season one. I am now finishing up season two of Valeria. If you've watched it, you know that it is amazing. It's about this amazing lady. I think she's 28, if I'm not mistaken. And she got married very young. She's going through early midlife crisis. But yeah, check it out. It's on Netflix, Valeria. Um, I think this season one and season two. I'm currently on season two and I am loving it. I started it yesterday um, and I watched through the entire night. I slept I think this morning at around about five o'clock. Um, so I'm running on four hours of sleep, but it's fine. We're not gonna die, it's okay. Um, right now I need to blend some lemons and some mint for like a a winter concussion, vitamin C, whatever you want to call it. Um, yeah, flu season is upon us. I'm currently recovering from flu. Uh, yeah. But anyway, um, I will see you guys on another one. Bye, guys.